insulting people, insulting races. He needs, we are all humans, we are all Americans. We all came from an immigrant nation. He needs to know his history really. Trump is coming to tell us today here that the violence is due to video games. Mental health. Let me say this, and we need to say it clear and loud. Trump is responsible, and he is part of the problem. We don't deserve to have this happening here. And now we have a president who I think is the, one, is the big cause of all this, showing up here, having the audacity to show his face here. It, it angers me, just the fact that we're being attacked for no reason, you know. The, everyone complains about Im immigrants coming this way, you know, looking for a better life, but it's not their fault, you know, they, they're just looking for a purpose. I'm just here to tell you that I'm ready to stand with you as we say no to hate, no to bigotry, no to racism, and yes to love. Words matter. Words matter. El Paso Snow. We are a united community, and, and that's why I'm here, because we want to, uh, we're down, we're going to go up from here, right? With love, with peace, with intelligence. We live in a country where we have a president who demonizes communities like this one, who vilifies immigrants, who says that those from Mexico are rapists and criminals. Change your tactics. We are not bad people. We are not invaders. We are not, like you call us, the Mexican Americans, the African Americans, the. We are not the. We are human. Please treat us like humans. We were, we were aware from shootings ever since we were in elementary school or before. El Paso has, has been one of the safest cities in the nation from, for many years, and I never thought it would happen here. We want the government to do something. We are tired of everything that's going on around this nation. We are El Paso strong.